Welcome to Spotlight. I'm Karen Polka, and I'll be speaking with Andrew Seppo. Today's show is sponsored by Women's Life Insurance Society. Good morning, Andrew. I'm so glad you're here. Yeah, thanks for having me. You are the Executive Director of Operation Transformation. Yes. And Operation Transformation has many, many facets, but tell us a couple things that you're focusing on right now. Yeah, so so our summer um, is one of our busiest seasons of the year, just because everybody comes back to the Blue Water area, it's a lot of fun. The weather's finally great in Michigan, which is good. Um, but one of the biggest things that we do throughout the summer is our event called Family Night. It's during the Mackinac, the Port Huron Mackinac Boat Race Week, um, and it's that Thursday, it's going to be July 13th this year, and so we have um, on the lawn of the 10th Street Bridge, the south, the southern lawn of the Black, River, the Black River, we have over 60 different vendors who are coming to fill out this huge um, space. We actually have a waiting list right now of, of people who want to get, be involved with that, so it's really cool. We've got a petting zoo, we've got a bounce house, we've got um, different educational things. Every booth is going to have a free uh fun event for a kid or a little prize for them. We're gonna have uh, vendors selling food. We're gonna have live music from the stage where there's a dunk tank. I mean, there's just, there's a lot of stuff going on um, and it's gonna be a lot of fun. It's gonna be from, uh, I think, 4 to 9 p.m. Um, again, on that southern lawn of the Black River, just uh, east of the 10th Street Bridge. So you can't, you can't beat this time. No. You know, families coming out, whether you have children or you don't have children, yep. you know, you want to come out and have fun. We're going to be making a beautiful, me will be making some balloon dogs, hey, handing them out. Come Those on are now. kind of fun. Those are huge. Yeah. Yes. So people, it's a free event. Yeah. And what a great way to uh, embrace summer, embrace the area and provide families a resource. Absolutely. And, and that's kind of what it was born out of, which is a need to find free uh, free opportunities for families. Um, we have a lot of people in the area who've got lots of kids, and uh, sometimes it's hard to kind of, you know, go to, to, to a carnival or to something like that where you have to pay for a lot of the events, and it's just, it's an opportunity to give kids a fun summer event to look forward to every year, and it's, we've been doing that now, I think, 18, 19 years. So it's been a it's privilege, been it's grown every year, um, and, and we're excited to, have, to be able to host, for sure. So a dunk tank, so do people get to have an opportunity to get in the dunk tank, so, or can we try well, to dunk someone? Yeah, so what we're doing, I think we're still kind of <laughs> fleshing out the details, but I think the hope is to, I think it's like you pay a dollar and all the money raised is going to go back to a local charity in the, organ in the area, um, but we're going to have different local pastors, local, uh, try to get some community leaders, so if you're a community leader and wants to help out, <laughs> have people dunk you for about 15 minutes at a time. Um, I'll be in the dunk tank sh for sure, so you guys can come and dunk me. Hopefully it's a nice warm day for <laughs> it. Uh, but yeah, it, it'll be an opportunity to raise some funds and have some fun while you're at it. So It's really great. Yeah. Well, we're looking forward to that on yeah. July 13th. Yep. But the other thing that goes long almost all year long yeah. for business people. Yeah. Yeah, so we have a, a ministry called Compass. Its the full title is Compass Christian Business Alliance. Um, I just I'm new to the role, so I, I kind of ask questions like, why is this still a long title? It doesn't matter. It's a beautiful opportunity for people who are professing professing Christians who who love the Lord, but want to come together and encourage each other, equip and connect with other Christian business people. And so uh, we meet every third Wednesday uh, of the month. Um, and it's, we have a speaker who comes in. We have some games. We have lunch provided. It's, 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 a, it's a good time of just connecting with people. And so we're hoping to encourage those um, who are in, of like faith that there's more of us out there and that uh, how, to, how to best uh, practice uh, throughout our own personal lives, where we're at in our business, whether we own a business, whether you're, uh, you know, uh, I don't want to say lowly, but maybe, maybe you're not so high in the totem pole, and, and uh, it doesn't matter where you are, you have an opportunity to, to, to worship the Lord with excellence wherever you're at, and it's just want to, want to connect people in that way. So that means, yeah, it's, so, it's all throughout the year. So it's a luncheon. Yes. And it's only about an hour, hour and 15 minutes long. Yeah, yeah. We, we, we tend to start around 11.45 a.m. and go until about 1 o'clock. So, yeah. So it's a great lunchtime experience to connect with people. Yes. I really have always enjoyed coming to it. Yeah. And, you know, the games are fun. They're short sweet, uh, you get fed, you oh, get yeah. fellowship. It's just a great, uh, yeah. a great once a month thing that should be on your calendar. Oh yeah, I mean, I mean we have some phenomenal leader or communicators that come in and talk. We had, uh, I think two months ago, we had a former Miss America that came and spoke. Um, we've had world-renowned uh, authors speak. We've had, uh, we have the, the Tigers, yeah, the Tigers uh, chaplains mm -hmm. coming to speak in, in a little bit. So we have a lot of, a lot of awesome opportunities and we're not just trying to find, you know, random people to speak. It's people who've been in the business world, who've, who've been successful 
and who are professing Christians. I want to share how their story, how, how their faith has influenced the decisions that they've made. And uh, it's just, again, it's really encouraging. I look forward to it. In my past life, before I came back to the area, I was, I was a business owner as well. So I'm really, I, I love this because it's, these are my people. These are my, these are the folks that I, I connect with very well. So, yes. yeah. So how would we get a hold of uh, someone to know how we can come to it yeah, and where so it might be located. You can check out our website, michigancompass.org. Um, and we have uh, even a tip of the month written by a local business owner, um, Aaron Hewitt, who he's not an owner, but he, he's, a, he's, a, he's a local businessman, yeah, businessman yep. in the area. Um, it has, we actually have three different um, uh, entities that meet at this. We have a, a Western Wayne County one, a Macomb County one, and we're here in St. Clair County as well. So you can find out information uh, about where they're meeting, what times they are uh, and, and you can sign up for it on on that website that's true because yeah. there's other places that people could go that might be seeing this right now yeah, and yeah, you don't yeah. have to come to port Huron, that's but right. you might go to the others so yeah yeah really yeah. wonderful yeah well so andrew one little thing what's your favorite ice cream oh i that that's a tough question i wasn't prepared for this but it's okay <laughs> it depends on on the season if i'm feeling a little more sweet usually i'll go like a cherry amaretto if i'm feeling a little more like Chocolatey. I usually go like a mint. I like I like uh, like uh, Cold Stone, where you can mix your own stuff, and I do mint with Kit Kat, crushed up Kit Kat, and mint is really good. So. There we go. Yeah. <laughs> you never know. You never so know. want to get to know people. That's right. So. Yeah. Right. That's right. Well, yeah. Thank you for joining us today. Hey, you're welcome. Thank you. And thank you for joining us on Spotlight.